just when you thought there may not be enough characters, today's Nintendo Direct teases four extra arms fighters. What's up everybody, it's Zach from Switch Force, joined by Jake and Gabe, and today's Direct was awesome. We got arms release date, June 16th, a new character, Min Min, new modes, two on two, but if you pay extra close attention, you can see that four extra characters are teased. Now, this would bring the total roster up to 10, which I think is a much healthier number than the five we knew before today's announcements. So let's go through and talk about these guys. They all look cool. I think that the visual design of ARMS is is just spot on. <sighs> Zach. What are you signing yes. for? <laughs> but I'm, I, actually, that was a sigh of excitement, really, because like I want to know more about these characters, and I want to know their names, and I want to know what their abilities are, and I'm looking at them, and they look very, very cool, specifically the second one. Uh, Zach, we're going to go one by one on these. Yes, so uh, the first character on your left um, is a girl who looks to have some sort of mask. So I don't know if this is like a jester or a magician or an emoji girl. It kind of looks like she's got like a, a winky eye or something uh, on her mask there. But she's got the earrings uh, and the mask, perhaps like a desert-themed or a jester-themed or, or something of that sort. Every character seems to be like pretty darn themed in terms of... You know, uh, Ninjara is a, is a ninja, and you've and got like now... a bandit cowboy and has rope arms. Ooh, cowboy is one of the name. Yeah. But to, to be fair, most humanoid characters... Well, they're all humanoid. But uh, most, like, regular size characters in arms, they all have masks. So, like, I don't think the, the mask is, like, anything... Well, I, just the fact that it's covering one eye, I think, is... A little interesting. Do we know that, or do we, or maybe that's just her eyeliner that's blue on one side and pink on the other? Yeah, we, I mean, we don't know. Maybe she's just we, a, like I mean, a mixed matched. The and, mask and is Harley, clearly... She's like a Harley Quinn equivalent well, yeah. or something. Either way, she looks awesome. And, uh, you know, if Min Min is a hint at what's to come, I think that they are rivaling Overwatch with incredible character design. I, would, I wouldn't go anywhere near that far, but okay. I think so. I, li I like these guys a lot. I think they have so oh, yeah. much style and charm. For sure. They have a lot of personality, like, also for, for characters that don't, like, really, like, talk a lot or anything. Next up, we have a man who... He's yeah. robotic. You know it's a man? It's like a yeah. robot. It looks, yeah, it's a robot. It honestly looks like one of those, like, the things you put the quarter in, like the viewfinder, yeah, look out. and now yeah. look really far. Just yes. Like, yes. Okay. Uh, here, let's play a fun little game. For each one of these characters, let's all come up with a name. <laughs> um, so for the first one, what would you name the, the first character, Zach, before we go on to the second one in full I, force? I really like Jake's cowboy theme, so I'm going to name her Casanova, and she is a cowgirl with rope arms. Okay. J Jake, what do you got? Uh, man, you're putting me on the spot here. I have no idea. Um, uh, Sally. There Sally. we go. <laughs> Sally, the uh, the special cowboy. Okay. Gabriel? All right. See, I'm the one that came up with this idea, and now I'm stuck. <sighs> we'll call her Lassie. Like, uh, like a lasso. Maybe one of her arms can be like a, a rope. Um, okay. And she can like lasso you in. Maybe she throws it, at, at, or you know, it goes and ropes you in and brings you in close for for a punch with the opposite arm. So that's what I'm going with. The second creature thing, robot here. Yeah, he he does remind me a lot of those like viewfinder type machines, but in a weird way, he reminds me of the ducks from Mario Sunshine. If you can picture these in your head, the like robotic ducks. He he's got like a. I don't know, for some reason, he gives me Mario Sunshine vibes. I'm just I'm trying to decide in my head if I think he's either a like very stocky like ball shape, or is he like a very <laughs> slender like 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 dapper gentleman robot. He's like one of the two. I just can't well, decide in my head. And you you think about how each character kind of has their own unique uh, move. So how Min Min today was revealed to have that kick. I feel like he's got to have something with his eyes. I don't know. Well, I think he's do something with those goggles. <laughs> I think that he, below the little screen, I think he has a mustache, and his name is Gustav, and he, like, Ooh. has, like, a, a nice, like, sidestep dodge or something. Next up, third character. Uh, well, wait, do we want to name this guy? Or are we abandoning Gustav. the game? Uh, Jake went with Gustav. I'm going to go with Manny. I don't know why. <laughs> okay. Um, gosh. I feel like it has something to do with his eyesight. Or... or or maybe like maybe his name is like Lasertron, and he's actually just like a, like Jake said, like a floating round robot. I am so glad that we're not in charge of naming these things. <laughs> Next up, we have Master Mummy's brother. Yeah, normally, when you're naming something, you don't just see like their eyes. <laughs> yeah, that makes it a little more difficult. But but third on the list is Master Mummy's brother, 
Um, <laughs> at first, I thought this was Master Mummy, but it's way too slender and has a different style uh, with, again, with the mouth and like the a, eyes. It looks like a robot with human eyes. I figured it out. I figured it out. I have a name for him already, too. His, his, he's not Master Mummy. This is Apprentice Mummy. And uh, this is uh, Master Mummy's pupil. And he is learning, but he's not quite there yet. But this guy doesn't have any band, like, wrap. He's not wrapped. It just looks like his white and purple is the same colors. This guy is clearly, like, a robot thing. I don't, or, I don't know. I went with the okay. whole Master Mummy thing. I don't know. What if one of these is Biff inside of a suit? <laughs> <laughs> What if this Master Mummy wannabe, is, this black thing on the right side, is like a dog ear, and he's like this weird, like... Like a Dalmatian. I was actually thing. thinking that. I was thinking that. <laughs> he's oh, like, dear. He's Dr. Dalmatian. Dr. <laughs> Dalmatian. Or what if he's a doctor? What if he's like a med bot, kind of like Baymax from Big Hero 6? Yeah, but he looks too angry to be a med bot. If anybody's going to be a med bot, it'd be like the second or fourth guy. Okay. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna name him Doctor Digits, anyways, because he has. He's gonna have like a whole bunch of long fingers that extend and punch everyone. He has ten arms, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful, uh, and possibly the best of show award goes to the fourth teased character, uh, is robotic. He down on his back? Is that where Robo- we're supposed to start with him? Or is he like, it's, like it's, jumping it's in a, the air and doing This a is a bend? fusion, but this is a fusion between the maid from the Jetsons and a giant pickle. <laughs> Uh, no, and, and like one of those like belts that has like emojis on it, or I mean, Watch Dogs too. Um, the 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 mask for what's that character's name? That's basically what this is. No, this is Wrench. like yeah. This looks like Gumby as a robot. So I'm gonna name him Gumbo. <laughs> Daft Punk wanted to make a pickle uh, <laughs> sidekick, and so they came up with this. Gumbo. I think it's interesting that the characters we have so far are all very human like aside from Mr. Mummy Master Mummy sorry who I guess is a mummy but Min Min Spring Man Ribbon Girl they're all dudes and dudettes all of a sudden we got three things that I don't even know what they are and I love that I love that fact um so yeah this is this is the strangest one and like why are they laying down I think he's like jumping in the air and doing a back bend Oh, so he does like a flip. That would be cool. Or this is his pose for the picture. He's overly dramatic. He's like a drama <laughs> bot. Regardless, I'm just excited that that it seems that we're getting more characters. So I, I can't wait for those to be revealed. Yes, I think ten is a great number. If there's more, fantastic. But ten makes me feel so yeah, much more confident all the arm about the lineup. Is, is right with definitely... all yeah all that customization. Because remember, each character not only do they have their own moves, but you get to modify that even further with the the many arms that you can attach, and then you know the different pairs that you can create out of all those different you know arm options. So really a lot. Um, let let's uh, let's pick our favorite of these four. Hmm. I, I I'm I'm gonna go with with the second one with the weird goggle eyes thing that you can look I... out. <laughs> I think the first girl looks pretty cool, but the prospect of the third being a dog has me really excited. Yeah. <laughs> I, do, I do. Like, like, what if it's like an upright, standing on like hind legs Dalmatian? Wolf. <laughs> What's his name? Wolf. No. W a l f. That's what he says because he's like a robot dog. Oh, wolf. I was excited that you combined Walter and Wolf into into forming Wolf. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. Good. Sure. Uh, did we name the final pickle? By the way. I, Gumbo. P- I'm gonna call her Ms. Pickles. <laughs> I'm gonna call uh, Mrs. Pickles. <laughs> this is amazing. I I my favorite is definitely okay. My 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 f- fake favorite is the pickle thing because that's amazing. But my real favorite is the girl on the left. I think she looks awesome, and I love I, I love the character design in this game. I think it's so colorful and so vibrant, and that each one has their own personality. I do hope that they bring amiibo. I think amiibo of these ten would be just. Killer. That's a lot oh, of them. Are, are they gonna do skins for them too, like different colorways? That'd be intense. I mean, they they have to have some sort of colorway if you're fighting duplicates, right? It might just be a palette swap versus like a, a skin, but I mean, I would. They're, they're so intricate already. A palette swap would be See, so different. This is where I want them to, to riff off Overwatch and do like seasonal events. So you have like Christmas outfits for all these guys, Halloween outfits. Give it. Let's to just us. do our job and spread the word about this game so that it sells well, and then they'll do that. Yeah, we are very excited for ARMS. Again, it launches on June 16th, the Friday after E3. Ten characters, multiple modes, motion control, standard control, unlockable ARMS, vertical gameplay, arenas, and a whole lot of fun coming to Switch soon. Until that time, though, everybody, let us know your favorite of these four new characters, and if you have any insight into what they could be, names, body shape, careers, 
form factor. Let Careers. us know what you think. <laughs> well, like, okay, a doctor, a dog, a, a pickle lady. A dog is a career? <laughs> I want hey. to go to school to become a doc. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, the world is your oyster, or whatever they say. Uh, anyhow, thank you guys and girls so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe to stay up to date on the latest and greatest from ARMS, Switch, Nintendo, and us. Until that time, though, everybody, thanks again for watching. Hit that like button if you enjoyed today's uh, very exuberant video. And until next time, Switch Force out!